Yo, welcome back to another video of posting up with the Parkers. Holla. Don't say that. Don't say that. No, no, no. <laughs> Why? We're in 2021. Yeah, so? We're not saying holla in 2021. You know how many like throwback stuff is, is back right now? Holler. No, 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 not holler. <laughs> Holla. We're not doing that in 2021. That's that Nelly headband. <laughs> Air Force Band-Aid. Stomped. <laughs> All right, let's get to business. All right, you guys, in today's video, we're gonna be talking about our home design upgrades. So to sum up, okay, there's two different kind of upgrades. One, there's upgrades that you do. To sum it up, you're breaking my wallet. <laughs> Whatever. One, there's like upgrades that you do, you know, with the design center that of the home, like where you're buying your home, your new construction build. And then two, there's other upgrades that you can do after they're done and like either DIY or you hire somebody else. Mm. So we're gonna go over kind of both of them, but really mostly just the design center upgrades. So first off, before we even show you guys the design upgrades and like the things that we like kind of went through at the design center, I just wanna let you know that, you know, if you guys do do like a new build or new construction, y'all don't have to do any upgrades. Mm. And also, it really just depends, I guess, like where or who you build with because some builders do give you better upgrades than other builders. So I would say like, honestly, not to be rude, but KB is very stingy with their upgrades. Yeah. Like they're, they're just expensive. Yeah. They're really expensive. They're nice. They're solid. They're nice, for sure. But if you're handy, then it'll be it'll, it'll be probably be better if you just go out Home Depot, Lowe's, right. Amazon. Or if you know somebody that's in construction yeah. or can do things like that. Um, and you can also just like look it up on YouTube. Like it's, they have a ton of videos on there and I feel like it's not as hard as you think. Yeah. But on top of that, like KV Homes, like their included features are just really like basic and they're like hecka old. Mm -hmm. Like there's like a lot of other constructions that we were, or a lot of other new builders that we were looking at had such better included options. Yeah. It's ridiculous, mm -hmm. but. But our goal was to make this house as modern as, as, as possible. Yeah, like modern, like, yep. modern contemporary, I would yeah. say. And luckily, she's really, really, yeah, she's more handy than me, because her <laughs> father. But, um, you know, we're, we got some of the upgrades from there, but we're definitely going to do a lot of the things ourselves. Yeah. So I think, honestly, we, we spent more in upgrades than we wanted to, or at least that we thought we were going to, but we spent it in the areas where, like, we knew... I couldn't do them or Johnny couldn't do them or something like that. Yeah. Like where like it was absolutely necessary. And then the other ones like we, we didn't do. So mm -hmm. for instance, um, let's get started. So the first upgrades that we chose were to upgrade our countertops and upgrade our cabinets in the kitchen. So actually throughout the whole house. Mm -hmm. So what was included in K at KB was like tile countertops. And that's not just for the kitchen, but for everywhere. And we were not about that. So yeah, like we that. upgraded to granite and quartz. We have granite on our island mm. and then quartz all around our countertops. And th this should be said on another topic. I gave her the reins on all of this. Yeah, that's true. All of it. I trust her judgment. I trust her taste, but I don't really care. Yeah. <laughs> and then, yeah, I told her just make it modern, make it look good. Mm -hmm. And you can just pretty much do whatever you want. So yeah. I'm, not, I'm sure not all men are like that. No, absolutely not. I was just kind of so just blessed. go do your thing. Yeah. But I mean, in addition to that, like I think Johnny just said that because he and I have very similar taste. And I, I asked him about everything. Like I didn't just like pick something. I mean, let like granted that he was like, oh, yeah, yeah, it's fine every time I asked. But still like. Just make, it look like a, just make it look like a man lives here, too. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty much And my taste is not girly at all. It's very, like, neutral and very, like, you know, modern, contemporary, little farmhouse-ish. Um, but, yeah, so everything in the house pretty much is just black and white. Mm -hmm. There's greenery, um, natural wood colors. But, yeah, I don't really like a lot of color in my house. I mean, I do in, like, certain areas, but I don't I'm know. With that. Yeah, and it fits with him. So, yeah. So, anyways... Back to, the, back to the kitchen and the countertops and the cabinets. Um, we upgraded our countertops, like I said, and then we upgraded our cabinets as well. So we went with um, the Barnett cabinets, which I have no idea what that means. It just looks like the shaker style cabinets, and then they're just all white. So that was probably one of the biggest upgrades in the kitchen. Um, and then along with that is we also converted the kitchen like layout. So it comes with like a range stove combo, but we didn't want that. We wanted just the stove top and then a separate like oven in the wall if that makes sense <laughs> no 
<laughs> Doesn't make Are you sense. talking about the oven and the fridge? The double? So the oven is in the wall. It's not like in a it's not like in a range. Yeah. In a range? Yeah, I think it's called a range. Make this simple for him. The stove is here. The hood is right here. Oh yeah, we upgraded our hood too. So the microwave is not the hood. To the right of it, microwave and then oven. No, that's not right. Yes, it is right. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. I'm looking at it. Yeah, that's something The stove different. is here. The hood is here. The microwave is here. Just because here. it looks like that in the design center doesn't mean that's not what, that what's, what it looks like in our house. It's not what it looks like in our house. So in our house, we oh. have like we have like the kitchen that's like this. Along this this wall are like cabinets and then our stove top with the with the um, hood. We have like a glass hood, which you guys will see here. Um, and then on this side of the wall is more cabinets with our refrigerator and then more cabinets with the oven and microwave. So it's different. But it, it, it's essentially what he said, but just along two different walls. So my description was a lot more to the point and easier for me. Whatever. I'm just saying. I'm giving them the real description. So yeah, so we did upgrade that as well, like the layout of our kitchen. And then we also upgraded our sink, which I love our sink. So it's kind of like a, it's kind of like a um, farmhouse sink, but it's with stainless steel instead of like the, the, damn, what's that called? Porcelain? Is it porcelain? Porcelain? I don't know if it's porcelain. <laughs> Shut up. I was right, it's porcelain. <laughs> And then we also want to upgrade our faucet, our kitchen faucet, to this matte black farmhouse sink faucet. But the buyers at Kate with KB, I mean, the design center with KB was way too expensive. So we're just going to buy one and then replace it. One, or we got the included one and then we're going to buy our own and replace it once mm -hmm. we move in. And then um, we also upgraded our dishwasher to have a nicer dishwasher. The dishwasher we chose actually has like four different levels. So it has like a compartment on the door and then it has like the bottom rack, the top rack, or the middle rack, and then it has a top rack as well, so it's pretty nice. And then we also upgraded um, for a pull-out trash can and recycle bin, which is nice. Um, we wanted to do soft clothes of everything, but that was just way too expensive with just them do it too. ourselves. Yeah, so that's something we're gonna do with, by ourselves as well, and that's really easy. You just literally just change out the hinge. And then our kitchen also doesn't come with like pulls or knobs. That's something that we are just going to add our own because the ones that they offered were like, they were nice, but it's just not what we wanted. Yeah, we found most of them on Amazon, I think. Yeah. I mean, yeah, all of them, right? Mm -hmm, for a good price, yeah, too. Yeah, all of them. We're going to get everything on Amazon for those. And the next um, upgrade that we did is our flooring. So what comes with the house is hard, or not hardwood, but like laminate or something kind of flooring and then carpet in the living room area and then upstairs is all carpet. What we did instead is we just have hardwood going throughout the entire bottom floor and then we have carpet going upstairs. So we got to pick out like from different options. We It was so hard for us to pick the flooring. Johnny didn't really care too much. I mean, he actually had some good opinions. But he really didn't care. And I was tied. Like, I, I don't know. I couldn't decide between these options. But finally, we went with one that's kind of like a lighter brown. And it has like a little bit of ash in it as well. I think we're happy with what we chose. I don't even remember how it looks. <laughs> so we're gonna find out when we get yeah. there. Yeah. Well, I mean, I kind of, I remember. But I think these pictures definitely don't do it justice. Like, it's yeah. so much prettier in person. And it's a little bit more brown in person than it is ash. All right. And then the next upgrade we did was our stair railing. And this was like a whole other story. So mm -hmm. the pictures that they showed us in the design center and like what they showed us there is completely different from what we actually got. Must have given us an outdated brochure or something. Well, I think they showed us other plan or other floor plans and it doesn't pertain to our floor plan. So yeah. that kind of sucked. It kind of like we didn't even know until it was being built and we were done. like, what's this? Like, this is not what we paid for. Mm -hmm. we, we paid for all open railing to like from downstairs all the way up and that's not what they gave us they gave us like ha like downstairs a little bit and then a little bit upstairs and then the middle wall is like a big wall it's, <laughs> it's not a pony wall it's not railing at all um so we were kind of disappointed but luckily like we did tell them like hey like this is not what we paid for and like we gave them a call and she was really kind like they got it cleared where they pretty much gave us gave us the upgraded railing for free um, they like kind of took back the credit or whatever it was. I don't really know. Quick. But yeah. We were able to talk to them pretty quick. So I wasn't Yeah, they got back to me pretty service. fast. Yeah, customer service was good. Yeah. yeah. And the lady that we met with to, to do all of our designs was super nice. We yeah, really like her. Was. Yeah. But anyway, so we did upgrade our railing. Um, and we, we only paid for like a little bit of it. We really didn't have to pay. We got like most of, like half of it for free, I would mm -hmm. say. Since they messed up. 
And then so we also upgraded the granite in our bathrooms. So we got granite countertops and then for our shower we converted that they only come with in the master bedroom a like walk-in shower and then, like a linen closet I really wanted that linen closet but Johnny over here decided no he wanted to get we have we have six or seven <laughs> linen closets in the house <laughs> oh, I wanted to, yeah. I wanted to experience a tub because I'm gonna use it I work out I yeah. want bath so instead of a linen closet Johnny opted for a tub so this was like really his only request so I was like okay of course you can have my loft yeah, in his loft. Um, we didn't. We were gonna convert that to a room, another bedroom. Um, but Johnny wanted that as a loft instead. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, it's nice. I think it's really nice. Like you know, the the granite that they put up for the the shower and the tub looks beautiful. Um, it's just the shower is like a lot smaller than I thought it was gonna be. Mm -hmm. Now that the tub is in. Yeah. But it's okay. Yeah, I mean, it'll be fine. I think it'll, I think the tub will come in handy. You'll, you'll want to yeah, use it. Yeah, I'll probably use it for sure. We also really wanted to upgrade our sinks. To this really beautiful like square sink it's too expensive but it was way too expensive oh my gosh we probably just get those upgrades like at lowe's or home depot <laughs> well i don't think we can because they have to like cut the granite into that shape but honestly it's not a big deal like it's just a sink and... that's what i said to be honest I, like i said i'm a minimalist so i was yeah. telling her it's just a sink it's all good it's just a sink yeah. i think it's gonna work either way i mean i know it looks pretty cosmetically but good not job a deal. done yeah Another upgrade that we really wanted to do was upgrade our front door, but honestly, they didn't have the front door that we wanted, um, and it was expensive. It was way more expensive than the one that we actually want in the same quality. We found it on, what, Home Depot? I think it's Home Depot, yeah. Yeah, so we'll get on Home Depot. Yeah, so we'll just, we'll install it ourselves, and yeah. I've installed the door before, so I think it'd be fine. Mm. We also are going to upgrade all of our... Um, door handles and things like that so we just chose the included option just because they don't have the door handles that we wanted mm. johnny wants you want black right yeah white white and black yeah white, yeah black yeah. on white white on black yeah so johnny wants black um handles and hinges so we'll upgrade those ourselves um we did upgrade doors our in interior doors um to this like really modern door i think it looks really nice johnny loves them when he first saw them he was like yes no yeah i really like it yeah i like it a lot yeah so we upgraded all of those Johnny also upgraded, like all of the media stuff. So in the living room. Yeah. So we have a we have a um, a surround sound system. I think it's a mm -hmm. five speaker a downstairs. Five, maybe five point. Five. I think it's called a five point. Mm -hmm. Yeah, five, five point. point downstairs. We had them do the wiring for four cameras. So outside, mm -hmm. uh, one in the front. All around the house. Yep. One in the front, two on the side, one uh, one on the back of the house. Mm -hmm. Um. So yeah, I told her I'll take care of security. I'll take care of security. Get in my loft. Give me the tub, mm -hmm. and I'm good. Right. Other than that, else. yeah. Because you saw all those windows. I think we have like 12. Yeah. We have, no, we have 14 windows downstairs. Uh, yeah, we have some kind of crazy number of windows downstairs. So, so, yeah. It's a lot of windows. A lot of curtains. A lot of, a lot of window shades. A lot of sensors. A lot of sensors, yeah. So, That's okay. Yeah. And then on top of that, we also upgraded like all of our TVs to be hung up. Or like I don't know how you say mounted. that, like mounted. Yeah, so yeah. It like sh doesn't show the wires. You just put it through the through the wall. We upgraded like pendant lights in the kitchen. Um, they actually didn't come with any lights. We wanted to buy our own, which is good because it saves us money. Yeah. Um, but we paid for like the pre wiring for all of them. I think we paid extra for the outlet in the garage for the electric car since we have plans of getting the Tesla. Yeah, some kind of adapter thing yeah, for us. That we so, needed. Yeah, it so that when we get the Tesla, it'll just be. Yeah, I needed to do it now. I didn't want to a good do, install. It, do it later. Yeah, so. I think that's pretty much it. We didn't do any upgrades to the backyard. It comes with like a covered patio. We could have upgraded for like the side yard to be cemented or like mm -hmm. an extra slab. But we have like our own design plans for the backyard yeah. where we don't want that extra like cement slab or whatever. And then, and then the cost that they were asking for for just like a little walkway in the backyard for where like the trash cans go out to the front. Yeah, that was ridiculous. Yeah, so we're just gonna hire somebody else to come and do that for us. Yeah. And maybe we could try to figure out doing our own. Like, maybe maybe i don't know that one might be a little bit tricky but yeah other options that we're gonna do ourselves are probably like the backsplash in our bathroom backsplash in the kitchen um we're gonna do like accent walls and i'll kind of take you guys through that too when i do the empty house tour i'll let you guys know of like everything that we're gonna do you want to do your pantry doors yeah we want to change out the doors so we want to change out the pantry door the laundry room door and then um the we want to do like a barn door in our master bedroom that leads to our closet walk-in closet yep we're gonna convert the garage like we said in our last video 
into like half of a gym and then the other half will just be like our, for our car yeah. one of our cars and <clears> then um we'll have like a little mud room in there and then johnny's wine fridge will go in there might do like a little conversion in our kitchen actually where we have like a little nook like usually people do like little nooks of like either bars or coffee bars but we want to do one for like a wine yeah, just for the conversion. everyday bottles and the glasses that are right there. Yeah, and we then, have a ton of wine glasses. A ton of them. So, or even just champagne, like any kind of like drinking glasses. Um, so we want to put them there. Maybe like have like clear cabinets or take the cabinets off. I don't know yet. And then maybe like put in like those. I don't even know what they're called. Like the wine holders with like the the X's, like the crisscross. Yeah, the one that holds like just four or six bottles. Something Everything like else, that. Yeah, all the other ones that I store, would just be. In. Yeah, just be in the cellar. But yeah, so I think that'd be like really cool. We just have to make sure we like plan it in a way where it's safe for kids. So like, I don't know, like we'll show you this, like this one that we saw in the design center that we really liked, but we just don't know if we want it to be like having the wine glasses that low where children can like touch them and stuff. Yeah. But who knows? Maybe it's it'll be fine. We can like teach them not to. So. Yeah, this will be a lot of prep. These mm -hmm. next couple weeks are going to be really, really busy. So we actually move in to our house in about two and a half weeks yeah. so we have a lot of new things coming up so on top of like all the upgrades that we want to do um and like us just moving in general um we have a lot of other things coming up like we said we're getting another dog we're gonna be in a new place i'm gonna have a new job yes praise god yeah so it's, it's gonna... definitely it's gonna be busy i'll be working from home mm -hmm. i mean he's already working yeah so home. i'll still be working from home she'll be going to the office still so it's gonna be mm -hmm. me and take me taking care of the new puppy yeah and then i'll probably be taking a couple of days off just to really just get things situated in the house mm -hmm. so she doesn't have to do everything when she gets home to be honest y'all i don't think he can do it by himself oh watch out he's gonna need my guidance watch one out. he doesn't know where everything goes watch out he can't do the projects without me watch out i'm <laughs> just saying watch out it'll definitely be it's definitely gonna be a lot yeah it'll be a hectic first month probably two yeah and then what sucks is all the stuff we had planned that we're gonna order and be delivered everything is on back order yeah. or like just out of stock yeah. or it's gonna take like forever to yeah i don't know it's just it sucks but it's okay no, i mean i guess that's out. covid problems so let's just be exactly. blessed that we have a house especially during covid yeah that we both have jobs yeah so. the main things we just want to get in there is our appliances so definitely a fridge yeah so we gotta bed. get a fridge and our washer and dryer yep. those and are the, two, the, the three bed. things that don't come with the house yeah and then our bed yeah other than that i mean we could really just we can get them along the way but yeah so that's pretty much all of our upgrades that we did with the design center i feel like we might have missed a couple of them but Maybe. that's okay we'll put it in our um empty house tour we'll kind of like talk you guys through the entire thing of like all of the ideas that we wanted to do and then all of the upgrades that we did so we're so excited stay tuned for a lot of like diy projects that we're going to be doing for home upgrades home decor stuff new puppy a lot of things coming yeah you'll enjoy that one all right y'all well thank you for joining us Stay blessed, mm -hmm. stay safe, mm -hmm. stay prayered up, yeah. and we'll talk to you guys soon. Yep. Peace. Bye.